And no democracy is complete without access to transparent and reliable information. It is the cornerstone for building fair and impartial institutions, holding leaders accountable and speaking truth to power. I have a communication uh, strategist uh, joining me from the United States to talk more on this. Good to have you on the news, Rashida Thomas. Hello, good morning from Washington, from uh, New York actually today. Oh, you're in New York. Okay, great to uh, note that. Now, well, let's even ta start from this year's theme, w which talks about media for democracy, journalism, and elections in times of disinformation. Now, how do you begin to navigate uh, through this? Well, you know, it's interesting in, in the United States, uh, press freedom has never been more attacked. Um, our current president, um, it constantly, I mean, daily attacks the press. Um, he sent his press secretary out to talk to the White House press corps um, many times a week, and she blatantly lies to uh, the American people. So in the United States, um, where the fourth estate has always been protected and where press freedom is codified in our Constitution, um, in our First Amendment, this has, um, it's actually the worst time in our history, I think, for press freedom. And really, how important is it to have access to transparent and reliable information, especially in countries uh, like where you are, uh, compared to uh, Nigeria, where I am? Well, I think uh, across the world, no matter where you are, it's important to have uh, press freedom and, and transparency. Um, people should always be able to speak truth to power. People should always, citizens of any country should always be able to take their rulers to task, and they should always uh, get the truth from those in power. It's, in, it's extremely important. And, uh, it, well, and just before I let you go, journalists and the journalism profession is uh, become a target of anti-democratic forces. That's right. How, yes. How do you begin to change that narrative? Well, I think um, in the United States, um, for one, people are speaking out, and we have to continue to speak out. You know, we are a democratic government. Um, each man has a, and woman has a voice here, and it's incredibly important that people continue to stand up against tyranny, against fascism, against uh, the lies of, of any government and any attempts of any government to quash the freedom of press. People must continue to fight and speak up. All right. Um, Rashida Thomas, communication strategist, thanks for joining us on the news.